For our CAM project, we designed a fish feeder. During the design process, we realized that our CAM would not function on a faller. Therefore, we put our minds together to construct a gear and pinion to make our CAM function as a switch. The 1 to 12 ratio between the gear and the pinion allows us to slow down the 1 RPM motor. The ratio allows us to have two full rotations within a 24 hour period. We calculated this ratio because one does not want to overfeed a fish, which would essentially result in death. Instead, you only want to feed a fish two times a day. Viewed in the animation, the fish feeder is made up of 11 parts. A pinion, a gear, a motor with frame, two axles, a spring connector, a funnel, a funnel holder, the arm, and the arm connection. Function of the motor and frame is to power the gear and pinion while holding the axles in place. The axles then turn the gears, driving the cam around with the gears to flip the arm, otherwise known as the switch. The switch then drops from the mouth of the funnel, releasing food into the fish tank. If you take a look at the force diagram chart, you will notice two large peaks. These peaks show the contact forces between the bottom face of the arm with respect to the angle the face on the cam. These contact points allow us to see that our switch is functioning correctly when in motion in SOLIDWORKS. Through hours of production, we have been able to make a waterproof fish feeder logical, effective, and cost effective. We made our product all plastic so no parts would rust while in or near the water. Other features of our product is your ability to change the time that the fish get fed by changing the initial position of the arm of the cam. Remember class, fish are friends, not food.